I'm wearing a nude lip product right now. I'm like actually addicted to nude lip products and I think I, itch, I like, <gasps> I have so many. I'm gonna, I don't know what I'm gonna, I, I, don't, I think I might cry a little in this video. <laughs> I need to man it up. Not man it, women it up. I don't know. <laughs> Today we're gonna be decluttering all my nude lip products because oh, I have a lot of nude lip products. And I feel like I just use like a few nude lip products because I don't see all my other ones because they're all just like all messy and I can never find what I'm looking for. It's just everything's a mess so I feel like I need to go through all my nude lip products and maybe next time I'll do like a bright lip product declutter. Would that be cool? Let me know. Um, but yeah, so I think we just need to dive into decluttering. <laughs> So the first category, category category that we're gonna go into is like my brownie, my like true true brown nudes. So I have my lip glosses, I have my shimmery like lip glosses that just kinda like add shimmer to your lips. Then we have some liquid lipsticks, we have lipsticks, we just got like a little bit, everything with my brownie nudes. So here we go. So the first step is, so let's say I run out of all these lip products, which ones would I repurchase? So I'm gonna grab the ones that I'm gonna repurchase and I'll swatch, we'll play, we'll just chat about them, so yes. So the first one if I ran out of, I would repurchase this Marc Jacobs lip gloss. Oopsie, I kinda tightly packed them in there. But the Marc Jacobs lip glosses are just so creamy, so like buttery, and I honestly, I just love the shade. This is in the shade Sugar Sugar. I feel like it's that perfect brown gloss, you can apply it on top of anything, so this is a keeper and I totally repurchase it if I ran out of it. Next would be the Kylie lip glosses. These are actually phenomenal. They're super creamy, they're pigmented, they're glossy, and they just have amazing shades. I have the shade So Cute, which is honestly such a cute, <laughs> such a cute name. Um, so cute and literally, they are just so literally amazing and they're just, I love them, I totally repurchase. I'd also repurchase the Anastasia Gild, 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 Gilded, it's hard to say that, um, Gilded Lip Gloss. This is such a cool formula, honestly. It is super creamy. It's truly like that perfect lip topper. It's super creamy, it lasts long, and it just doesn't feel glittery, so Anastasia Gilded going in the good bin, <laughs> or like the repurchase bin. I'd also repurchase my Wet n Wild Liquid Lipstick in the shade Nudie Patootie Allus, all oh, what? Honestly, it's such a cute name, and I just love this shade. It's like my neutral lip shade. It has this like brown purple tone to it, and when I apply it on top of anything, it just kind of neutralizes it, and it makes it just more brown, so yes, yes, and yes. Then Bite Beauty Honeycomb. This is insane. Such a pigmented, creamy lip shade. It is actually like, oh, oh, I can't, honestly. Like, can you? It's just like so beautiful, creamy, and it smells actually so good. Like, honestly, it actually fills the air with smell. It actually smells like flowers and refreshingness. Oh, I can't. I'd also repurchase my NYX lipstick in the shade Beach Casual. It is actually like that brown nude goals. Like it is just so pigmented, creamy. It actually reminds me of the Bite one, but just like, oh, it's just, ah, oh, oh, I love it. I feel like I just, I can't go wrong with this brownie nude. I'd also repurchase Boho from Nude Sticks, and yeah, it's just so like brown. Honestly, this is the only shade that really looks good on me that's a super dark brown. It looks not like poop, you know what I mean? <laughs> Sometimes I am, yeah. But it's like that perfect like brownie rose toned brown. Oh, it's just, it's very flattering. Um, Boho from Nude Sticks is amazing. And that's pretty much everything I'd repurchase. I, oh gosh, I don't even know where to start. Okay, I'll start over here. So this is a ColourPop Glossy Lip in the shade Weirdo. I haven't tried this one on my lips yet. This is it right here. I feel like it might be really nice, but I don't, I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna keep this one because I haven't tried one lip gloss from ColourPop, so this is in the keep bin. And I like the shade too, I think it's really pretty. I'd also keep my Essence lip gloss in the shade, what is the shade? It's in the shade Almost Real. I think I'm gonna keep it because it honestly kinda looks a little peach on camera, but it actually has this brown peach tone to it, which honestly, when you apply it on top of anything, it just makes it more like warm and just f fluffy, while we're all fluffy. Just more just like homey feeling. I don't know, it's just more like warm tone. So you may be thinking, Fiona, is that just one big swatch right up here? It's actually these two lip glosses are both honestly completely identical, as you can kind of see right here. Um, so I think I'm just gonna keep one. I think I'm gonna keep the Essence one. NYX Butter Gloss and Peanut Brittle is the most warm tone brown you can get. Honestly, I can't. I love this shade. It is so warm and just, when you put this on your lips, it's just so, God, I love it. It's just so warm and brown. I, it just reminds me of the holidays, but like, not the holidays. It's just so warm and cozy feeling. Not feeling, but you know what I mean? It's just that like, warm, cozy color. 
Then we have a tart lip paint. This is in the shade Bestie. And honestly, I, I'm not sure about this. I think I'm going to pass it because I feel like it's just not like, it's not a shade that I really like. Then we have this Revlon lip gloss. Honestly, I think I'm gonna pass it. It's just been so old. I got this like so many years ago and I just, I don't, ugh. it's just kind of really glunky. I don't know if you can see that. It's just, I don't know. And I don't like it really that much. It's like this weird shimmer. I don't, I'm, I'm not into it. So I'm gonna pass this. Then we have this City Color Lip Gloss with Argan Oil. This is the most glittery, most, I don't really like it. Truly, I feel like it's actually like weird and just like, it's really gritty. Like when you put it on your lips, it just feels like you're putting grit on it. It's like, I don't know, it feels like there's sand in your lip gloss. So I'm gonna pass this. I don't, I don't know, yeah, I, it just didn't work for me. Then I have two of these Milani liquid lipsticks. If I'm not mistaken, they're the same, but they're just repackaged. These are the Amore Matte Metallic Lip Creams. They're both in the shade 01, so I'm, yeah, okay, I just need to keep one. Which, I think I'm just gonna pass this one along because I haven't used this one, and I've used this one. Then I have all these shimmery lip glosses. All I'm gonna keep is the ColourPop one because it is the only one that I feel like is actually like, like a nice one from the drugstore. And I just like the formula on this like shimmer lip gloss, so I'm gonna keep that one and I'm gonna pass Oh, should I pass these? Oh my gosh, it's like I know I just I, I it's hard for me to pass them all along But I know they're gonna go to a good home, so I don't know uh, oh, Shoot, I don't know I'm gonna keep the wet and wild one and pass this one along then we have a Revlon lipstick This is in the shade 01. This is like my neutralizing lip if you will like honestly if I apply it on top of anything It just kind of makes it more neutral and more brown so I'm gonna keep this because I just I like how it's just very brown So I'm gonna keepy. I'm gonna keepy keepy. I'm gonna keep so I'm gonna keep this and I'm gonna shift all these down So now okay, so oh gosh, okay. This is an Anastasia liquid lipstick in the shade stripped. I really like this I'm gonna keep this I'm gonna pass along ooh, This NYX liquid suede. Well, actually no wait. This was actually my favorite. Oh, oh my gosh I remember this now. This is like one of my favorite brown liquid lipsticks I completely forgot about it because it was kind of you know hidden around in all the stash But I'm gonna keep this this is in the shade stand sand storm and it's just that perfect brown liquid lipstick NYX liquid suede what? <laughs> I'm gonna keep this buxom lip crayon because I paid a lot for this. I remember like buying this. I was a little bit like, oh my god, it was super expensive. So I just I can't get myself to like pass this one along. And it's truly like such a beautiful like just oh it's such a pretty nude. Oh my gosh, whoa, that's actually really really pretty. Okay, I think I need to wipe my hand off. This is getting to be a lot, <laughs> but I'm gonna keep this. So now we have the last few lip products. I'm going to get rid of these three. This is just like an old Milani lipstick. It's kind of really crusty. Then this like color jolt and this NYX liquid suede. I feel like somebody else would love these so much more than me because I just, I don't, I don't, I'm not, I'm not gravitating toward them. And also this one. This is for like one from Laura Mercier. It's like so like, ah, it, when you put it on, it makes your teeth look really yellow. There's like, it's just like, ah, I don't like it very much. So I'm going to pass this one along. So I'm going to keep these three. So yeah, that was my brownie nudes. Now we're gonna go into mauves. My head looks so funny here. Um, now mauves. So these are all my mauves. So I'm gonna keep this Makeup Forever liquid lipstick. I recently got it. This is in the shade 015. And it's just like, wait, oh, uh, it's like that purple, pur purple pretty much. It's that perfect, pur what, what? It's a perfect purple. I'm also gonna keep my Milani liquid lipstick. This is in the shade 03. I love this formula and it just smells actually like heaven. Not heaven, but like cupcake heaven. I'm actually gonna pass these two along. This is a little Tarte liquid lipstick. It's like a Tartus lippy paint. And this um, Stila one, I, it's so, I don't really like the formula on either of these, so I'm just gonna pass. Same with this ColourPop one. It's just like, I'm not digging it. Then I'm gonna keep my Anastasia liquid lipstick in the shade Pure Hollywood. It's definitely more of like a violety, like bra, I just, I love, bra, what? No, they're like, no, I can't, I can't even, I don't even know how to describe it. It is just so pretty and I stained this, uh, whoopsie. Um, let me just kind of pat that, that made it more of a mess. Okay, let's just ignore that. Um, but I really, I just, ah, I, I love the formula and it's just Anastasia, you gotta keep it. I'm also gonna keep this Nude Sticks lipstick, or it's like more of like a lip crayon in the shade Whisper. It is like, so, uh, oh my gosh, it's so creamy. Like, can we just, it's so beautiful. I just, I have to keep this one because I, ha, I just love it. It's like definitely one of my favorites. Then I'm gonna keep this flower little like lippy crayon because I, I, I don't know, ah, uh, it's definitely more of a sheer color, but I feel like it's actually kind of pretty. It has this like sheer, like, uh, mauve. I don't know how to describe it, but I'm kind of into it, so I'm gonna keep it. Keep the keepy. 
Then I have these little mini bite lipsticks. This is in the shade Peppa. Peppa. I like the name Peppa. Um, but I, I just like the shade because I feel like it's a definitely like a, mm, how do you describe that? It's like a definitely a deep mauve. And I just, I love the shade so much. And then I'm also going to keep this shade Fig because it's a fig, you know? Like, when you gotta go, you gotta go. Oh, that did not make sense. Um, it's definitely more of a bright mauve, but I love this shade, because I feel like it's just like that bright mauve that whitens your teeth, which is awesome, because <laughs> I've got some yellow teeth. Then I'm also going to keep this Rimmel London lipstick. This is in the shade 705 First Class Nude. And I just, I really love this shade. I feel like it's very creamy. It's pigmented. It's that perfect, like, oh, how do you, oh, how do you describe that? Oh, nice man, girls. I love this shade so much it's like a lavender mauve and it's just so creamy Rimmel does such a great job with their lipsticks I'm also gonna keep this little like lipstick this is in the shade rose from nude sticks like can we oh I love you lovey I know I'm not getting rid of a lot and what I know I'm not getting rid of a lot of my mobs but I just love them I'm also gonna keep T rose from elf because I know you're probably like Fiona I think you're keeping almost everything but truly I just I love my mobs and I don't really have a lot of well I do but like I don't want to have to like buy more, so I'm keeping. And then I'm just gonna pass along this pit, 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 pitch, pitch, pixie. I can't say pixie that well. Pixie by Petra Lip Cran because it's just not my cup of tea. Now I'm gonna go into my pinky peaches. <laughs> Coffee break. Do you guys like my mug? It says Crazy Cat Lady. That is so me. Um, oh, I love coffee. I'll have to say. So, peachy and pinkies, here we go. I'm gonna keep this Wet n Wild liquid lipstick in the shade Nude Peach. Uh, it's pretty much what it is. It's like a nude peach. It is super creamy, love the formula. It's from, whoa, why is it patchy right now? I don't know, but honestly, like, can we? Oh, it dries to this like perfect peach. I can't, like, I, well, I can. I love it too much. Um, I just can't, I just, oh my God, I don't know. I love this, I'm gonna keepy keepy. I'm also gonna keep this NYX Intense Butter Gloss in the shade Peach Smoothie. I love, love, love this because it is a pigmented peach. Like, as you can kind of see right there, it's just like a peachy pink that is insanely pigmented. And I honestly, I could, oh, I, mm, I wanna eat it because it looks so pretty. That doesn't make sense, I don't know, but I love it. I think I'm gonna pass this along. I don't even know what this brand is from, I just, I don't know, it's just really not flattering on me and I don't really, uh, yeah. see, I'll just watch it. It's just too light, it makes my teeth look super yellow, so I think I'm gonna pass this one on. I'm also gonna keep this Blossom Lipstick from Nude Sticks. It is so pretty, it's like a light, I would say it's actually like a pinky blossom shade. It's blossom, I said that's so funny. Um, but like, I, I just love it, it's just so like creamy, it has this like mauve, pink peach tinge. It's like everything you need in a little lippy. So you gotta keep Blossom from Nude Sticks. And I'm also gonna keep my Marc Jacobs lip gloss in the shade Peach Chickle, Ch Chickler, Peach Tickler. It is like a glossy, really light peach. And what I love about this is when I layer it on top of any like bright colors, it just makes it pop more. So love this and it's Marc Jacobs. So you gotta keepy keepy. Keepy keepy. Honestly, I feel like I've said keepy keepy a lot, but you gotta keepy keepy. <laughs> Then I'm gonna go in with my Tarte Lippy Paint. The one I'm not gonna go in with it. Uh, this is in the shade Get It, Get Out. Um, but uh, that's such a funny name. Um, but it is truly like a peach lip. What? 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 Liquid lipstick. I really like it because it has this like light peach tan, tan, tangerineness to it. And honestly, I have to. Well, do I have that be keepy keep? Oh, I'm gonna keep this because I really haven't had enough time to try this. I'm gonna pass this absolute liquid lipstick. It's just in the shade Terracotta, and I don't really, um, yum, yum, yum. it's like, it's okay. I just, I'm not digging it, so I'm gonna passy passy. I think I'm gonna double double my words. Like, hi, hi, what's up, what's up? I don't know, I don't know. Um, anyway, and how, I think, yeah, okay, this is a Revolution lipstick in the shade Loveline. I'm not sure, should I keepy keepy? I think I'm not gonna keep, oh, should I keepy keepy? I don't know. I think I'm gonna keepy keepy. It's kind of like a pinky peach. Well, <laughs> this category is pretty much a pinky peach, but I'm gonna keep it. I haven't tried a lot from Makeup Revolution, so I'm gonna keepy. Ooh, now it's gonna get hard. Okay, I'm gonna pass these two. Ooh, why is there a hair? Oh, great, there's always a hair somewhere. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, wait, there's hair. Wait, I just saw another hair. Oh my gosh, there's another. Okay, uh, hair heaven. Um, so I think I'm gonna 
pass these two. This one is from Smashbox. I'm just not digging it. It is, um, yeah, I'm not even gonna swatch it because honestly, that's exactly what it looks like. It's just kinda, it doesn't look good on me though. I don't, yeah, I think it will look so, so much better on somebody else. And I'm also gonna pass this Bite lipstick because I feel like somebody else is gonna like it more than me. So yes, these two are going, going. I'm gonna keep this little Tarte lippy like balm. It's like a tinted lip balm. If you have dry lips like me, this is their like tinted lip balm line from Tarte and they have so many amazing shades. This is just like, oh, I, I can't. It's so creamy, it's so gel-like and it moisturizes. I love this, so I'm gonna keepy keepy. <laughs> I'm gonna keep my e.l.f. lipstick in natural because truly I can't get rid of this because I have so many memories with this because I wore it to BeautyCon, I wore it to Generation Beauty, I wore it to so many events that I just can't get rid of it. So I have to keep this. It's bad, that's a very bad swatch, Fiona. Um, but I have to keep because it's just so beautiful. So now I'm gonna get rid of this Kylie liquid lipstick. I feel like somebody else is gonna like this. This is in the shade Coco K. I'm just not, I'm not digging it. I don't know, I'm just weird. I don't, I'm not weird. But well, yeah, I am very weird. Um, I'm gonna pass this as well as this Milani liquid lipstick in the shade Loved. I feel like somebody else will like this more. And if you're curious, where are you gonna give these? I'm gonna probably give them to my, like, my friends or the woman shelter because I feel like the woman shelter, like, you know, I feel like they would maybe enjoy these. So I'm gonna pass these two along. I'm gonna keep this Milani liquid lipstick in the shade Darling. It's, it's truly like a darling shade. It's just so sweet and it's such a, like an oh, like can we, oh. Honestly, if I could wear a pink, this is the only pink I'd wear because it has a slight purple tinge. Okay, that's actually really, really pretty. I'm kind of digging that, digging, digging. Um, but I really like this, so I'm gonna keep this. And Milani has amazing liquid lipsticks. And I'm also, ooh, should I keep this? I think I'm gonna pass this. This is like a Laura Geller lip gloss. Uh, I'm just, I am yeah, it's just pretty much like clear. So we are D-O-N done. This is what I'm keeping and this is what I am giving away. That was a lot of nude lip products. Um, but I'm super excited because now I feel like I have a lot that I will actually see and use and just use more nude lip products and different ones. So thank you so much for coming and decluttering with me and huggy huggies. <laughs>